All right, so if you want to turn on your transcription uh, within your Zoom environment, uh, it's really pretty simple to do. The first thing you want to go is to zoom.us, this is the main Zoom page, and you're going to go to sign in. Once you sign in, you'll be here at your, media, your, your home page, and you're going to go down to settings. Once you go to settings, I recommend doing a control F. Uh, that is to find and just type in transcription and it'll bring you down to this area here. So what you'll want to do is make sure closed captioning is on and then you can check all of these boxes. The most uh, important one is allow live trans transcription service to transcribe meeting automatically. Uh, that's the most important thing that you want to check. You can have these other ones on, uh, but this would probably be the most ideal Sometimes you may actually want to save the transcription. Um, you may find that useful, especially if you're trying to uh, keep track of things. So you can also turn that on. But the big thing is to make sure closed captioning is on and this but this middle button here is on. All right, so let's go over to the Zoom environment to see what this looks like. All right, so now that we're in the Zoom environment, we're going to see along our, our uh, toolbar here on the bottom. And we'll go right to the CC or the live transcript. We'll select that and then we'll ignore this stuff up here and what we want is live transcript, enable auto transcription, make sure uh, this button is, is checked to allow participants to request live transcription and just select it. Once you select it, you'll see it'll pop up down there at the bottom and you can let students know that if they themselves are also wanting to have closed caption, they can go to their toolbar and select live transcript. Uh, you'll also notice that the uh, words will sometimes change or flicker because the machine is trying to live uh, figure out what you're doing. So sometimes the punctuation isn't great, sometimes the words aren't perfect, uh, but it does a pretty good job considering this is doing this live. So that's how you turn on transcriptions, that's how you get them up and going, and hopefully this is useful. Let me know if you have any questions. Thank you.